For the fifth time in Bellator history, we traveled down the River Liffey to the Jam Pack Three Arena. And Josh Thompson, we got things started with Oliver Enkamp and Lewis Long, and the Swedish Karate Kid was outstanding. He looked absolutely phenomenal. We talked to him this week, and he did everything he said he was going to do. And you see the finish right there with the spinning back fist. They ended up landing with the elbow and the jump in. Nicely done by Oliver and Camp. Next up, a bantamweight battle. Franz Malombo, a teammate of James Gallagher, against the man who defeated James Gallagher a number of years back. Ricky Bandejas, Malambo was good early, but then it was all about Bandejas. Ricky Bandejas came in here and did exactly what he did to James Gallagher and shocked the world. Caught the kick Malambo did, and beautiful two right hands and followed up until the ref jumped in. Big opportunity for Rowdy Beck Rawlings against the 21-year-old from Greece. This is one tough young lady. Beck Rawlings knew she needed a victory and she gutted it out. Yeah, she had to dig deep for this fight right here. Beck Rawlings was able to hit, hit a bunch of submission attempts, trying to get to that top position. Almost had the fight won at the end of the second round. The time ran out. She was able to get to the back, control the top position in that third round. That's what won her the fight. Undoubtedly, the fight of the night was our co-main event of the evening. Yamik Furtado and the very popular BDK, Kiefer Crosby. He came out fast, hard. He was able to get that takedown early in the first round, dominated the whole first round. But Furtado was able to take control in that second round and won that round. So going into the third, Kiefer Crosby needed to dominate through the burst at the end of the fight, got the takedown, and was able to get the victory. Kiefer had a son on Tuesday, gets his arm raised here in his hometown tonight. Finally, our main event of the evening was the finish of the night for the former lightweight champion. Brett Primus did exactly what he was supposed to do. He came out here and silenced the crowd within the first round, just like he did against Tim Wilde. You see here, he jumps on in on the legs, able to kind of work his way up into pulling into a, to a double leg, gets to the top position, ends up circling to the back, Figure fours, gets that jaw lock, cranks and opens them up. Nice finish, nice tap for Brett Primus. For the latest news and information, go to the Bellator app or bellator.com. Hans Christian!